All right, friend, well, I have a box in front of me and that could only mean one thing. Yeah, we're gonna do a review on a print, although this is not a metal print and this is not a canvas print and this is not even an acrylic print because I mean, the box is absolutely small. Uh, this, I'm pretty sure, are some tiles actually yes, from Paint Attic Studio, which uh, you may recall last month and I think the month before we reviewed some prints from them and they were actually pretty cool and so i decided to to give it a go with their little tiles that they have here now let me get you up to speed as far as in case this is your first video that you're watching uh on this channel here uh, for the last four or five years uh, we started doing uh, canvas print uh, reviews and then we did and started incorporating metal print reviews uh, this year we're going to be incorporating uh, acrylic print reviews and we actually started doing uh, tile uh, reviewing different uh, tile companies as well those photo tile things and the premise behind this is over the years we've heard a lot of noise from you folks talking about where you would go to google and you type in best metal print best canvas print and you see a website that is basically telling you a list of uh, companies that have the best prints of whatever medium that it is there. So you would order a print and you get it and you were quite disappointed. And we, we hear a lot of these horror stories. But when you start looking at some of these websites out there, all they're doing is they're putting together, they're taking marketing collateral from these print companies, putting it together in some list form where they make an affiliate commission off of it. I don't like that. In all reality, they have never even touched the print. So it's unfair for you folks because you're making a financial decision based upon a print that they're telling you is the best in the market and you get it and it's rubbish. And so, and that's even more of a problematic uh, for many of you that are professionals that are drop shipping to clients and so forth because that print now becomes an extension of who you are as a professional. So at any rate, that's what we have going on here. That's why we do these things. We do our reviews a little bit different. If you haven't noticed, there is an actual print in front. So I'm gonna crack this open. I'm gonna share with you things I like. I'm gonna share with you things I don't like. You may agree, you may not, but ultimately at the end of the day, if you decide to buy a print or these photo tiles in this case from this company, you have a good idea of what your dollar's going to get you. Now, this is not part of any of our shootouts. Uh, this is, this is, well, at the end of each year, I'm gonna talk and do this at the same time. At the end of each year when we have our little, uh, our shootouts and so forth, we announce the winner and so forth. Uh, and then we also let you guys know, hey, if there's another company or there's a brand, there's a product that you would like us to test out, so leave a comment, let us know. Send us a neat message and we'll, we'll give them go and so forth. Uh, some of you had presented this company right here, Paint Attic Studios. And so we started testing out some of the prints and was absolutely blown away and so forth. So we're gonna have our actual regular shoot offs towards the Q3, Q4 each year. So this is just kind of tooling around and just having a little fun with some reviews. But as we can see here, this is, we have a bunch of foamy stuff in here. And okay, so these are the prints or the little tiles and we have empty box padding all over the place in there. Okay, so I picked up, I think I picked up six of these things here. So this is gonna be pretty interesting. And as we can see here, each one of these has a little foam insert going around. Okay, so here we go and so these are, let me go back to this. I think these are about eight by 9.2. I'm actually on their website right now because I forgot what it was. Uh, no, these are eight, no, these are hexagon, excuse me. So these are eight by 9.2 inches. Uh, and so you have a double-sided tape on the back and it's made out of, it's like a composite of some sort. Okay, let's actually get these out. So, cause honestly, I forgot what images I, had done on these here. And what we'll do is we'll evaluate these after. I'll share these with you after rather. And then ultimately at the end, what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a scorecard and evaluate everything and we'll call it a day. Okay, cool, 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 okay. So let's take a look at these, these photos here. Obviously, you guys have seen my son many times over. Uh, this is him and his grandmother. This is at uh, Point Magoo uh, two years ago. And so what I'm doing right now is I'm looking at 
first is first, I'm looking at color. I'm looking at noise. I'm looking at any sort of blemishes or wackiness that could have been a result of the actual print itself. This shot always cracks me up. This was a uh, Hawaii a few years back. And of course my son being a six year old, being a little wacky, that is still one of my favorite shots right there. This is Anza Brega last year, which incidentally you get a chance to go down there. A lot of fun. And what I can tell you right now, guys, these colors look absolutely, absolutely incredible. North Rim, Grand Canyon, by the way, super fun. Um, that was a fun, that was a really fun trip. These colors are really fantastic. I, I'm not really sure what this material is made of. It's, it feels like a composite, like almost like a plastic of some sort. Uh, the edges are all nice. And so the idea with this here is these work... You, you peel it off and you can organize these up onto a wall, which I thought, I love the shape of these things. Now these guys have different shapes. They have the hexagon square and they have rectangles. They have uh, eight by eight squares and they have eight by six rectangles. But what I thought was pretty cool with these here is as you can see, let's see if I can actually do this here. Eh. You can have a couple rows like this or you can, you know, you can see with the hexagon, it makes it fun. So I, I really like the shape that these guys had here. And it seems like a perfect size as well. Um, I'm going to put the price on the screen right now. And I will say this, the shipping of these was actually pretty darn quick. I just ordered these, I want to say Thursday or Friday last week. It's Wednesday. So they, they made it across country and pretty darn fast. But the colors look really, really good. Let's take a look at the scorecard. All right, friends, and there you go. This was the review of the Paint Attic Studios wall tile. I have to say, they these are compared to the metal prints and canvas prints. There's really not as much to inspect, you know, with the exception of the colors, looking for noise, you know, printer wackiness, and so forth. Uh, the edges are all nice and, and soft. The the decals on the back or the 3M tape on there, I mean, that's pretty straightforward. It's just stuck in the middle there. But they did a really good job on these, and I really like the unique shape of these as well. But it's that time of the video where, friends, uh, hey, I'm going to ask you to do all the YouTube stuff because we really appreciate it. So uh, consider hitting the like button, subscribe, and hit the bell for all notifications so every single time that we come out with a new video just like the one that you just watched, well, YouTube is going to do its thing and give you a heads up that that video is ready for you to watch. But, friends, that is all I have here for you today. So I hope you found some value with this video and I'm going to be shutting up the cameras so you get out there, stay healthy and take your best shot.